Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Honest K-Pop Reactions. My name is Steven. I'm Josh. And he's Josh. That's what I just said. Are you going to keep going with me on that? What, I was supposed to say you're Steven? Yeah. That's stupid. God Let's damn it. Where's Kelvin? Let's not do that. Just kidding. He wouldn't have done it either. Let's not do that. Um, so, hey, guys, we're back. We had just finished our reaction to... Sunny, mm -hmm. and now we're gonna move on to the one we're really excited about, <sighs> hyped up for Miss A's <sighs> Hush. Susie, now Susie, Susie, oh Susie, I don't fanboy much, um, but Susie, but Susie though, but that Susie, that Bay Susie, that Susie, um. So, Miss A in general, sorry, but Miss A does have a four-minute problem a little bit, right? Which is, mm -hmm. there's one person in the spotlight, not saying she's the best, just one person in the spotlight. Mm -hmm. um, what are your thoughts on Miss A in general? It's strange, because to me, in Miss A, there are better singers, and there are better dancers also, but... Compared to Susie. Or compared to, to Susie, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But, she's the worst one, I think. She, she's you know the cutest I mean, one, but she obviously is the most attractive for, to me, but and to a lot of people. But there, but Faye definitely dances better. Min definitely sings better. So and dances better, I think. Yeah. But what's the other girl's name? Gia. Ah, she's good too. I think Gia is really attractive. Yeah. I don't. <laughs> Shame on you, Susie. I only <laughs> see you. Uh, just kidding. Actually, we were watching the. I never really noticed Min, but when we were watching the YouTube Music Awards and she was presenting, I was like, oh. I wasn't like that, but I was a little like, oh. But also because we've been in Korea now for two and a half months. Yes. And, you know, not to sound super boyish, but like, you, you, I kind of got like, what's cleavage? Like, what's cleavage? I haven't, gone. I haven't seen cleavage in two and a half months. This is this is about as much cleavage as you'll see. Yeah, we were in Seoul once, and one girl was wearing normal cleavage, like things that I would see in the states. In the states, that's conservative, and I was like, "Damn, <laughs> 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 so so men on that on that thing, she was wearing a really nice dress, and I was like, "Dang, girl." Uh, but that's besides the point. Now, it's been a, about a year since Miss A uh, mm -hmm. released a song with... I don't need a man. I don't need a man. What? Um, which I actually felt don't was I? a long time ago. I thought it was way longer than that. Um, mm -mm. Because it feels like they've been out of the spotlight for so long. Mm -hmm. um, and part of that is just so many things are released every year. And also, Susie kind of is off in her own world. Well, everyone else, shits of money. Everyone else, too. That's well, true. Like, like Dancing, Dancing with, with Stars. stars. The, Master Chef? Master Chef, yeah. I don't know what maybe Or some does. cooking show. It's a cooking show, I know, but maybe it's not. Um, but Lodi the other Bong's big thing, which we talked about on our podcast, mm -hmm. which you should check out if you like podcasts, This Week in K-Pop. Or K-Pop. Um, is that uh, JYP usually produces yeah. and writes all the songs for Miss A, but he it, swagged out, he's dyed his hair blonde, got married, and he's like, yo, E-Tribe, take over. You got it. Now, what's E-Tribe uh, famous for? Not famous, but what's his big... big My hit? favorite band, Sonya Shide's G, Girls' G Generation. G it's a good song? Yeah. They're also known for Lee Hyori's You Go Girl. Which is the best Hyori song that I can recall. And I don't know if a lot of you know this, but I really like the song. M Black's Cry. I really like mm -hmm. that song. I know Simon and Martina mentioned that once. And I was like, cool. M Black? Yeah. That's an awful name. I don't want to. Music boys love absolute quality. <laughs> or something girl, dumb. Smokey like. girl, smokey girl, smokey um, girl. And also E-Tribe has his girl group, Dal Shabet, mm. which I guess is not doing too bad, but I also haven't really liked any of their stuff. So we're worried, right? We're like, yo, JYP, I've always relatively liked Miss A songs. Mm. Um, so uh, let's check it out. Finally, we talked a lot. Let's drool a lot. Water. Oh. Speaking of those beautiful eyes. Oof. So this is exactly like the teaser pictures. <laughs> They're just screen caps. Oh. Susie. That's kind of freaky. I think this concept really fits Gia. 
Yeah, she looks good. She's really good. Hush. Oh. Oh. Ooh, oh. What the? Who's here with us? Oh. oh Can they be my hands? <clears throat> oh. They're, so they're feeling oh. each other. Oh. So that's like the big trend now in Korea is like wider face and red, red lipstick. It's always, it's always been. It's always been big. Yeah. Oh, white, see. white faces. I know white faces. faces. Oh, I actually, it's really sexy. So there's a. Oh, Ooh. oh. But damn. Oh. Oh. All right. It does sound different than their normal. It does. Dirty bathrooms, not sexy. Dirty subways, also not sexy. Not sexy. I can't keep my eyes off of Gia, to be honest. Like, I Wait, love Susie, but... This is not a Susie video? <laughs> I know, I was like, when is Susie coming out? I'm busy looking at Gia. To be fair, she's really not, like, really focused that much. I think they do a good job of relegating her to the position she is in this which is the least useful. Just creepy mannequins in a deserted in a, uh, in supermarket. A trash supermarket. Not sexy. Oh, okay. I like this chorus. This chorus is good. <laughs> okay, calm down, calm down, calm down, breathe. Creeps me out like bondage shit. <laughs> oh, oh, black, like plastic. Yeah, the leather. black leather stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really like it when girls wear like tight white things. Are right? you like tight white pants? White leggings are in. I really like white tight shirts. Oh. Yeah, this concept is definitely sexy. Just wish they were in Ooh. sexier locations. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, not places where I need a tetanus shot. <laughs> like I can smell some of those places, and it's turning me off a little bit. That's it. No. Huh? How do you feel? I really like the chorus. Mm -hmm. I kiss, kiss, don't kiss, know kiss, if I kiss. like the other parts. I, I have to listen to it again. I wasn't really, like, <sighs> hit yeah. by the song. The video was very sexy. I, I will say, though, if it was an unknown group and I saw this, I don't think I would like it. Um, because mm. it's a little try-hard, like, to be mm. sexy. Um, it's not quite, like, Girls' Day rubbing, yeah. but... Very similar to AOA's Confused. Mm -hmm. Very similar-ish to a lot of things. Um, but since I do know who they are, and they've always kind of been sexy, mm. um, you know, it's not that bad. Um, I don't think the video is that good. I don't think there's anything special. Mm, see, I'm the opposite. I think the video is really sexy. It doesn't come off very try-hardy to me. Mm. But besides the chorus, the song's kind of... Yeah, it doesn't really have a lasting impact on me. But I do really appreciate the ground choreography. The bring it back from, what, good girl, bad good girl. girl. Yeah. Oh, that was... Oh, that was good. I think this song I definitely will like more more times I hear it. Mm -hmm. um, because Miss A songs have always... The first time I listened to a Miss A song, it's always like, what the... F what the fuck was that? Like, when I first heard mm. Good Girl, Bad Girl, when mm -hmm. I first heard I Don't Need a Man, mm -hmm. it's so different from normal K-pop. So, uh, just, um, 
it I just it just blew my mind. Mm. Not not always in a good way, actually. Uh, but the more I listened to it, I was like, okay, like this is Missy. And now that it's another dude writing it, I'm like, yeah. it's totally different. It sounds way more generic. It a little bit with the jung 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 yeah. jung jung. Like the sort of Spanish like acoustic guitar. For me, this song sounded like a bad sister song. <laughs> like yeah, like, a little bit. A little bit. Yeah. Um because like I can't they sing pretty well, right? Like yeah. I was watching the YouTube Music Awards and they were singing live, which so a lot of the other groups were not. Mm-hmm. And he, I mean, Susie is okay, but like the other girls were pretty good. And yeah. I don't think this song really showcased their singing Any very singing. well. Yeah, um, which is a little sad. But I get it's like more of a calmer, like sexier vibe. But mm-hmm. Sistar can do sexy and still have Hyorin's really voice, yeah. but she has a voice suited for that, I think. But this song definitely makes you want to listen to the whole album, which is mission accomplished for a title track. Yeah. I, I really like the concept, except for the dirtiness. Yeah, like, we've been in Korea for a while now, and the bathrooms, like, oh, yo, look like they look like <laughs> right that, back. they smell like that, ain't no fucking hot girls mm-hmm. in there, just poop. If there was Susie in there, I could stay out of there. No, even if Susie was in there, <laughs> there are some <laughs> bathrooms where I'm like, just come out here. Just like I'm stop, stop it. I'm just gonna get bowel cancer like, and wait. Feel me. Feel me. Come here. Um What are you doing? What are you doing? There? Like that's what I mean by try hard. Like what? I think it's try hard when it's like, okay, we we can be sexy. But we're also gonna make it arty. Mm. And so they're like, we're gonna make it sexy and arty. Oh, that's what you mean. And like that's what you mean. it was like it wasn't like like I said, girls they try hard, but I just don't like artsy things when it doesn't make sense to me. Like, what's sexy about a, a, a abandoned shopping market, or what's sexy yeah, about a bathroom or dirty subway? Like, it's not... yeah. See, for me, they hit sexy right on the nail. Uh, like, right uh, on the, the people, nail. yes. Yeah, the dance, hit, yes. Yeah, which is the main points of being sexy. But sure. then the whole music video kind of deflate. Like background, not even their outfits. Their yeah. outfits are nice. The outfits were good. The outfits were good. Really nice. <sighs> but yeah. the backgrounds are really bad. I can understand you're trying to go for the whole artsy, like grungy look, but yeah, just not feeling it. But overall, I actually think I like I like the song. Susie's this day's back. This JYP's back. like needs some hits. Um. And it sounds like he did a good job, Phil, to, maybe, giving us the e try, make it mm. sound a little bit different. It's no G. But, hey. G, 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 G. That's true, but MSA can't G, G, G. Um, actually, this is weird, because when you think about it, You Go Girl is a very cutesy kind of song. G, G, G is a very cutesy song. Dasha Vet songs usually kind of cutesy, cutesy, yeah. Cutesy, so this is very different. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, so if you liked it, We've been recording today, what, for two and a half hours? Easily. That's the last thing we're doing. So if Easily. you can please check out our other stuff. We recorded today, episode 32 of our podcast. It's a weekly discussion podcast called This Week in K-Pop. You can find it on iTunes. You can find it on YouTube. If you like him, subscribe. Like. If you like me, subscribe and like. And send me your phone number. And if you don't like me, that's fine. Like and subscribe. If you don't like him... Fuck you. Everyone likes him. It's not true. You don't like me. I love you. I love you. Sarange. All right. I'll do this for you. Until next time. <laughs> Until next time. Until next time. Susie.